Yes, folks, just in case you're just tuning in and wondering what's going on, we are here in the McKnight area. And as you can see, it says we believe that we are persons in the community will be honored. Yeah, we have in the person of um, Moyola. Everybody is a well-known uh, businesswoman in the community for your angles. Steve Archibald, a well-known footballer, and also Elbow, another entrepreneur, and just arrived with Marshall Henderson. We also have Samal Duggins, Minister Samal Duggins, and we also have um, P.S. Sido right here to celebrate. So, as I was saying, Everybody know Boyola, a well-known businesswoman in the McKnight area and she will be honored today alongside Mr. Archibald. He'll be honored in the area of sports, a very good footballer, so he's being honored today. Yeah, and also another person will be honored is um, Elbow. Elbow, another entrepreneur in the McKnight area. Now, it is not all bad that comes out of McKnight, you get me? Recently, we've, we've been plagued with some um, unfortunate incidents in the McKnight area. But we are here today to honor those folks who are doing extremely well. Ladies and gentlemen, good well, evening. As they are about to good evening, everybody. Session. All right, welcome to We Village Dad. We village that, and I want to say welcome to everyone here this evening, and you're in for a treat tonight. My name is Lachlan Tatum, and they've asked me to host this program, and we're going to begin this evening with the singing of the national anthem, singing or playing of the national anthem. Could you kindly stand, please, as we prepare to have the national
Thank you. You may be seated. The program tonight is not going to be very lengthy, and I'm not going to have much to say. But uh, we want to welcome all of you who are here. Welcome to the honourable members of Parliament with us this evening, and all of you who have come, those who are seated and those who are standing around. We're going to have at this time an item known as the blessings. Welcome, man, don't you? Haven't you? You feel welcome already. Okay, so welcome. Those of you who are from McKnight, those of you who have moved into McKnight, those of you who were born here, and so on, we want to welcome you this evening. We're going to make way now for the clowns. Are the clowns ready? The clowns. Where are they? Where are they? Are they coming? Should I get off the stage and get the clowns going? Or should you want need, you need more time? They're coming? Huh? Okay, we clowns are not ready to entertain us as yet. Well, you know, I see my name on this program and it says, I'm next actually, and it says um, I'm supposed to say a poem. I'm going to read a poem this evening, so I hope you will give attention to it and hope that you will um, be thrilled by what you hear about Mac Knight from this poem. I'm going to point out some things as, we, as I read. It's called Mac Knight. Mac Knight is serial with his joiner shop. Churning out furniture and carnival troupe called Zambezi. Mac Knight is a sweet Mac Knight is a sweet ping pong of Bendel's steel Orchestra. Some of you don't know anything about that. Magnite is satellite rum shop. Wait, wait. Tell you. Magnite is satellite rum shop with governs and Charlie Breadfruit and CC 
and deuce and bummy scratch magnetic circles and ball of corn. Used to live right here. Magnet is bad towel. And melody. Miss Thomas Preschool. Van Lowe Bakery and Taylor Shop. Magnet is Mr. Wilson Pharmacy. And ain't nobody know where that used to be. Magnet is Mr. Wilson Pharmacy. You couldn't go in there without a shot. You have to put on your shot and you have to wipe off your foot before you go in there. Right? Mac Knight is Mr. Wilson's pharmacy and Mac Knight is Miss Door Black Pudding and Miss Nan Pull Pull. <laughs> Mac Knight is Mr. Halbert Bookstore. Miss Hodge Store that sold clothes and shoes and baby things. Mac Knight is boys hanging out on the wall and Charlie's voice loud, loud about gardens, hospers and football. Mac Knight is six form boys and high school girls. Mac Knight is Mr. Sinkis in Ivan Frederick bodybuilding. Mac Knight is success. Mac Knight is pride and glory. Mac Knight, Mac Knight, Mac Knight. Got steps. Let's walk back up them steps. Let's walk back up them steps. Let's walk back up them steps. And remember who we really be. Who we really be and restore the glory. Thank you very much. Can't call everybody. Yes, of course. We can't leave out Miss Janet and her sugar cake. Too much, too much, too much. You want yeah, to be here? Yeah, you want to be here until tomorrow morning? A lot happen in this place. Right? This place. Remember Mr. Brasher used to pass you here in a car we used to say is a bulletproof car? Yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Give yourself a hand for coming out. I guess this is that one that you're here. And it's a man. Well, okay. Oh, if we're going to move on, said my poems, and we're going to These are write out the attention to that will be on this afternoon. We have on the oh, we have the clowns again. Mr. Archibald, the clowns, come on, Center of Ayola. Clown, let's go. Shum, kutum, shum, kutum, elbow, shum, kutum. Ayola will be. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. You would now feature the eyes on a folklore art form that is very unique to us as a people. The clown folklore art form started in the 1980s, in the 1800s, sorry, after slavery. This troupe has grown rapidly over the years. The costume worn is a floppy, colorful cloth decorated with tiny bells that fill the ear with a delightful jingly while the clowns perform. The original clown costume were worn with a long cone hat. The clown music must be slow. The clown has several dances that they perform. Can you name any? And everybody gone then is. Some of these are the catwalk and the Virginia reel. And the snake, you don't know the snake? Okay, I'm not gonna charge you for this information. One of the one of the instruments that I use in the band for the clown music is the fife. The fife then had to be made from bamboo. Now they're mostly made from plastic pipe. The punctuating crack of the hunter, a leather whip carried by each performer, serves to keep them in sync with the rhythms of the accompanying string band. In the same tradition, all of the local folk dances, our clowns wear pink wire mesh, gobby masks to hide their identity and allow for a total lack of inhibition. As they serpentine behind and between each other, the elegance and grace of this fun-loving flock of kittishans is truly a spectacle to behold. Now we won't have uh, a flock of clowns, but we have a demonstration by our um, carnival 
Marshall 2022, Mr. Sport, as he's well. Give it up for the clown. Thank you to, you know, I, I can't, I, 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 I just, very few of us could move our feet like that. Very few of us. We are, we are to acknowledge this evening the presence of Honorable Samuel Duggins, who is responsible for ministers. He's a minister of sports and the creative economy. We have a creative economy. Come on, give me a hand. We have a creative economy. Yes, and Miss, the Honorable Master Henderson, he is the constituency representative for Central Bastia II. Thank you, thank you for coming. It's, 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 um, it's not, yeah. You ever, you ever see, you ever see um, 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 Biden turn up to one of these ones? Small airports? No, no. Well, we are a small country and so we are close. Yeah, All right, well. we're going to um, we'll push right, right on. And at this time, we're going to have, I have listed next, Remarks by the Minister, the Honorable Samuel Cummings. That's what I have next. Pleasant afternoon to one all here present. I want to take this time just to acknowledge my sister in the mission, my good friend, the Honorable Marshal Henderson, constituency representative for Mac Knight and the entire constituency. <laughs> Today I'm here to just give very brief remarks on what I think is an outstanding initiative. Mac Knight, I want to repeat the initiative. Mac Knight. Yeah. Mac Knight. Yeah. 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 That's right. And this is what the initiative is about. Instilling pride. That's right. And the only thing I do here, come and listen, man. Here you the whole history of Mac Knight. I'm a minister. Bless up. Yeah, man. Remember Papa Grand Live 16 miles to come here. All the villages, peeping, peeping, never take a peep. When he reached in the village there and he looked at the map and he said, Wow, what a paradise. It's nice. I never turn a dice. Big up. Yeah, man. Papa Bracho, right here. Ladies and gentlemen, on this day as we gather here in the community that holds one of the top tier football teams, the Gallagher Spurs, to celebrate greatness of the community and its great people. This community has seen its fair share of challenges and has made the headlines over the decades. 
But what often does not make the headline is the many great success stories that take place here daily. And anyone who is honest could never deny that this is a community of resilience. Spanning from Westbourne Street to Five Ways and across the Fort Thomas Road, with all of its avenues and personality, the Matnai community has blessed our nation with sons and daughters in the persons of Kendrick Georges, the composer of our beloved national anthem. Ivan Frederick, one strong Mr. St. Kitts as he competed in bodybuilding. Lenford Hamilton, attorney at law. Our own Ian Rookie Phipps, owner of Party Central. Miss Lubina Phipps Maynard, former radio announcer, as I said. Nigel Numpy Williams, former music specialist at the Department of Culture. Mr. O'Loughlin Tate, poet, playwright, educator. And here you have your very own parliament, re parliamentary representative. Marshall. Marshall, Henderson. And of course, my peers, Ms. Valencia Sider. And these are but a few of the past and present success stories that have come out of this fruitful community. And these Star Wars stand as an inspiration to one and all in this community, reminding us all that life will always find a way. Right. Years ago, when I myself was just a little youth, the then Department of Culture began an initiative that some members of, from communities around the nation put into the spotlight of celebration and honor. These persons have strived for excellence in whatever they put their minds and hearts to often without realizing that their actions were being observed. And today, as I stand before you, as the Minister of Sports and the Creative Economy, I take great pleasure in expressing my gratitude to the awardees. Mr. Steve Archibald. For your stellar contribution in sports, in, specifically in the area of football. Miss Viola Augustus. For yeah. so your unwavering community service and excellence in entrepreneurship. Yeah. And Mr. Elvis Brown for your lifelong yes. commitment yes, and passion man. to our culture. Yes. Blessed man, blessed. Long time. You have served your community and by extension your nation well. And for all these years, and it is my hope and prayer that the Almighty God will grant you many more years of selfless service. And I want to now turn to our youngest, most promising creative awardees. Jason Smith and Daniela Jarvis. Today I give you these words of encouragement as you continue in the creative arts. And I wish to say to you, don't ever let anyone trample on your dreams, no matter how much they try. Get up, brush the dust off, and keep going forward always. Move forward until you achieve your goals that you set out to achieve, and make that night proud. And to the wider community, I extend my congratulations to you for just being who you are. And I ask you to continue striving for excellence. I ask you to overcome any and every roadblock placed in your way. And serve each other in the spirit of love and community, as you have always done. Matt Knight, continue to be proud of yourself yes. and the work you have done. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable Minister, for your very appropriate, I would say, words to our people. I'm so deserving. I'm going to teach them later, I'm going to get away. 
I have been asked to acknowledge also the presence of the on, uh, constituency representative. We have said that already. Presidential Bastia, also uh, permanent secretary, Ms. Valen Valencia Saida. Saida. Matt Knight at all. Matt Knight as well. Director of the team Web, the creator um, um, in the creative economy, and director Pierre Leiber, who is a great artist. I haven't seen a painting from him recently, but I know he could draw. So we're going to move on with our program this evening. Thank you, Minister, for your very um, appropriate and timely words. So um, at this time, we're going to have the awards. We're going to award, first of all, the most promising creatives. Um, Daniel Javis and Jession Smith. Award to Steve Archibald for sports in the McKnight community and entrepreneurship. Um, uh, persons who are responsible for the award. Good afternoon again. We invite Minister Douglas on stage as we award these two promising athletes. I mean, athletes, created in the Batman community from the Irishdale Primary School. So we begin with the boy first, Jessian Smith. We welcome you. Come, Jessian.
Marie, Miss Viola Augustus. Her willingness, passion, and the caring heart has materialized in the form of providing a hot and other types of means to less fortunate individuals, sustaining them for another day. Such selfless acts should never go unnoticed. Viola, or Vi, as she's affectionately called, inherited this generational trade as a retail shop owner from her mother, Rebecca Augustus, also known as Anne. This business has become a hallmark of the McKnight community and has been going steadfastly for the past 50 years and has served and benefited, yes, world of applause, 50 years, benefited many persons in and around the community. Vice stewardship and service did not, however, begin at her shop. I don't know how many of you know this, but for 29 years, she served the Federation with distinction as she protected the citizens of St. Kitts and Nevis in her role as police officer. 29 years. Ever the serving person, Viola now extends her services to the staff and students at the Irishtown Primary School and the Garden Hotspurs Football Club. When asked for encouraging words, for budding entrepreneurs, she said, commitment and genuine love for people is paramount. In business, one must exercise patience and be willing to serve regardless of distractions and negative attitudes. Thank you, Cayola, for being ever-loving, caring stalwart of the McKnight community. Premier League. 
Mr. Archibald is a leader within the team and one of the most valuable players. Right now, it? Thumbs up. His display of good leadership skills as well as talent on the field created a pathway for him to the national senior team. The Department of the Creative Economy takes this opportunity to recognize you and applaud you, Singman, for your contribution to sports and the community. May your passion and love for the game live on in the hearts of all of us for many years to come. Singman, Steve Ashman, for your invaluable contribution to the development of sports, especially football in the McKnight community. Steve Ashman.
long term, you know, long term I'm waiting now. It's a wonderful gift for a very special lady. I don't have a scripted um, profile, but she's no stranger to us. She's the biggest cheerleader here this afternoon. Oh my God. Miss Sandrine Duncan. Get involved in your community and to do things. We don't have many more items on the program this evening. We just have the final one, which is a presentation by the Huggins Masquerade. And we're going to move off the stage and let them come right now. The Huggins Masquerade.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah.
We're going into Wild Mass. Wild Mass. Shot and nice by Lolo. This is another dance in the masquerade. to shop the um, pharmacy before you say good morning, you know. And you said you're straight back outside, you have to say good morning. Yes, we get into the wild mass. Such a 
beautiful dance, such a beautiful day. This is Mac Knight, we village that. This is us. So I have the task of saying 
Thank you, Did Mr. DJ. Mr. DJ, kill the music. We could have a seat so long. Just one more thing to say thank you. I'd like to say thank you to the ministers for gracing us with their presence, for making this, this afternoon proceedings to be so beautiful. I'd like to thank all the awardees for showing up, the masquerades. I'd like to thank, thank the head teacher for the Irish Stone Primary, my friend. I'll be coming back at you in September, full speed, with my drums. I should have treated the students that are really looking out for that. Uh, who else to thank? Thank Pia Library for being here as well. Thank the, all the people from Map Night for showing up and being here and supporting. It's your own. You're supporting your own, so thank Sandro, Sandro the Map Night. And thank Elbow for opening up the shop. And we could, you know, use here for addressing area as well. I want to thank the, 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 the guy who cleaned up in, inside this little area here. I, I can't remember his name. But Calvo, but he did a fantastic job as well. So that is my due to say thank you. And we see us, see, see us in the next community. Keep listening for we will be dropping in again. Bye. I'm out. Thank as well, our host. Can't even multi-direct,
we believe that we are a number of persons who are recognized for their contribution to McKnight. We had six recipients in the persons of Viola Bay in the area of um, entrepreneur business. We had um, Elbow entrepreneur as well. We had Mr. Archibald Sports for specifically. We had Method Sanjin Duncan just general contribution to the area. Of course, if you're a magnite, you will see Sanjin in the in the area, in the village, um, just cleaning, cleaning the drains, making sure everything goes well. So I think it was a surprise when she got her, her recognition and that is very, very good to recognize persons while they are alive. We also had um, two children from the Irish Town Primary School, a boy and a girl. Yeah? And it was very, very good. And that shows you that, you know, we have good things coming out of McKnight. We have good things coming out of McKnight. You get me? When you hear about McKnight, it's not just only bad you think about, but there are some good things that are happening in McKnight and good people that um, came from the McKnight area. You get me? And um, Samal would have mentioned quite a few persons who are very successful who came from McKnight. And one of the persons who I want to highlight, his name was not mentioned, but is um, the former speaker of the house, Curtis Martin. He too is a McKnighter and he rose to that level. So again, it goes to show that it's not only bad you think about when you hear McKnight, but good people and good things are in McKnight. You get me? So we want to congratulate all the recipients and all the persons who came out to support and all the McKnighters who supported. Whether you were here or watching online, we want to thank you, thank you very much. I mean, certainly I am a McKnighter and it feels so good. It feels good to be a McKnighter. You get me? Yeah? I've never once in my life had an issue telling persons where I came from. In the heart of McKnight, Shaw Avenue to be exact. You get me, so If you are a McKnighter, you ought to be proud. Be proud of where you came from. You get me? Be proud of where you came from. And again, we just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. And as usual, it is always my pleasure to bring it to you live and direct. And I'm always happy to have you log on and tune in to Mother Pop. So until we bring you the next live, I say peace out. And of course, you can see my assistant is right here. You get me better late than never. Yeah, but of course, he's right here as well. You get me? So until we meet again, I say peace out. Thanks for tuning in. Peace.